hello everybody welcome back to my channel sophie it's my name if it's your first time on this channel and uh, today i'm coming to you uh with my new it's for the first time using this product i'm coming to you with my new kkw beauty uh product i have this uh, glam kkw glam bible and in this bundle this is how you open and still the package or that cream you i'm trying to open this and this is what is in the package we have the eyeshadow the six pen eyeshadow palette the eyeliner the lashes the mascara and this side we have the um, the two lipsticks the gloss the liner and the blush and the highlight this is what i have and today i'm going to review to see if uh, the kkw product really work for a dark african skin i haven't seen much videos of um, dark skin women from africa if i have to be specific uh, who tried or who have tried uh, this product i'm going to take out the products so that i can do a little bit of swatch here and there Firstly, going to start with the lip products, and this is the the package that fancy uh, clear uh, plastic package, and this is the classic icon one. This is like the the deepest. Yes, this is the deepest. Like this is a deep brown. This is a deep brown. I don't know if you can see from there it's like he said it has some peach or rosy undertones but this is the darkest and the lighter one the classic icon 2 this is how it looks like which i'm so scared for a person of my skin tone and this is how it looks like here is the lip liner it's also like light brown and this is how it looks like i'm just going to swatch this in the middle this is the one in the middle of the two lipsticks so it's more like similar to the lighter to the lighter lipstick which i'm also doubtful but the gloss they call it what it's just last here is the gloss it's a clear gloss i'm just going to swatch it here it's like a very creamy and moisturizing gloss i haven't really applied it but i assumed and it's it's very light as well so i guess this you can put on top of any lipstick that you'll be wearing or you can just wear it on its own with a little bit of a brown or any color lip liner that you want because as the day goes obviously the two colors will blend and it will give you a different shade moving right along we have the blush they call this the lux blush this is how the blush looks like it's very 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 clear i'm not too sure on my skin tone but we will see because i'm i'm going to try this today so we will see but this as it looks it reminds me of my jlo and inglot uh, the j125 even though that one is deeper it's not lighter it's not as light as this one but this it's uh it's very 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 light where am i gonna swatch this this is very 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 light but yeah this is what it is and then we have the highlighter as well this is the glitz glitz and glam highlighter this is like a a champagne they call it a what a pale eyes this is like a gold champagne or champagne color to swatch it next to uh, this is how it looks like it's just 
it just gives you that uh, radiant or that glow it's not like uh, the highlighters that we are used to that are like very very pigmented so this is just a subtle highlighter if i should say it's very subtle and then we have a eyeliner it's a black eyeliner and i think it's very intense as well just one stroke and it's there and then we have the lashes this is how the lashes look like these are like very natural uh, lashes i hope you can see so this uh this is how the lashes look like and then we have the mascara the kkw mascara let's see the wand this is one of those big uh, thick wand and apparently or oh, it's supposed to give you volume and length on your lashes and last but not least it's the the volume one smoky what do they call this the smoky here is the smoky volume one eyeshadow palette and we have the the cream shade we have the rosy pink shade we have the metallic silver shade the, the gray shade we have the warm brown shade and the black dark black shade and i'm quickly going to swatch them i'm going to clean and swatch them here so that we can see and here are the swatches here are the swatches the that uh, cream or ivory shade that pink rosy pink shade the metallic silver i hope you can see this the gray the warm brown and the black they look like they can work on my skin tone and the good thing i like about this this is a very compact uh, eyeshadow palette you can travel with this and create a couple of looks with this the matte looks and well you only have one metallic shade and it has a mirror as well it has a mirror as well i hope you can see and this is a six pen eyeshadow palette like i've mentioned and the names of the shades are at the back so without rambling a lot let's put all these products to the test and see if they will show and they do work for a dark skin african dark skin person i want to stress that one out african dark skin person so let's see how this will perform I'm quickly going to apply my my eye primer and I'm not even sure which look I'm going to create with this and I'm going to take that champagne shade and apply it on my brow bone I hope you can see I'm going to use this shade as my transition shade I'm gonna go in with my gray shade Oh, I'm mixing that gray shade <coughs> with the warm with the warm brown
I'm going to go in with the black, the black shade. And I'm going in with the brown mixed with the gray just to blend out that black. That black uh, eyeshadow. I'm going to apply a little bit of the of the mascara and then I'll put the lashes off camera and then I'll be back. The mascara, yes, it is volumizing. I'm going to carry on with that metallic uh, silver uh, to apply in the inner corner of the eye. So going in with the highlighter, the champagne highlighter, I'm just going to use my Real Techniques brush. Now moving on to my scariest moment, the lip products, especially the lip liner, I am, uh, I'm very scared. The lip liners, or the lip liner, it's very, very creamy. The color is not for me. I'm going to start with the light one, the classic O2. Huh? The classic icon two. Here is the first set of lip uh, product, the lip liner and the classic icon 2, definitely not for me and imagine if I were to top it on with the gloss, this is going to be a disaster. Like I said, here are the three products, the lip liner, the classic icon 2, and the lip gloss. No. I'm going to try the same lip product with, uh, with my lip liner, the NYX Espresso lip liner, and see if it will make a difference. So I am going to put a little bit of the gloss and see what will happen. But I'm liking it with the brown lip liner. It means I can wear these products. Not with their lip liner because their lip liner is not for me. It's for... Their lip liner is not for me. It's for people who are very light. So this is the first set of lips with a brown 
liner not the kkw liner so i'm going to finish off with that other lipstick and here is classic icon one and i'm going to top it on i'm going to put them to apply the gloss and here is the second set of uh, lip product using my lip liner so this is the classic icon one and the lip gloss and my brown lip liner and here is the final look using using the kkw product the eye look i'm not mad about because the eyeshadows they are very pigmented and they blend very easily uh, the highlighter is a very very subtle highlighter if you are a person who likes to glow uh, this won't work for you or you'll have to apply more of it so that you can see a little bit of that uh, glow or that, that shininess the blush as well yeah it does show my cheeks are a little bit rosy pink or whatever color it is uh, it does show i'm not too sure if you can see on camera the lashes i like they give me that uh, natural the eyelashes i like they give me that wispy look i'm not mad about i actually love them and what else the lip products that was my most fear when i purchased this because i was not too sure of the the shades those nude shade for a dark skin person like me liner and the lipsticks and the lip gloss um i'm not so so happy i'm not impressed but i'm glad because i can get away with them using my brown lip liner their lip liner i guess maybe i will use it on the waterline what else was there the mascara it's a uh, very very good i think i've reached the end of the video and that's it for this video guys i hope you enjoyed the video and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click the notification bell as well so that you get notified every time i make new uploads and with that being said it's goodbye from me